Hey everyone and welcome to the Lily Night Estate. I'm sharing with you what I got my daughter who recently turned 10 for Christmas. So I'm going to split it into um, all in one video but I'm going to split it into the things I picked for her, the things that she asked for and then at the end we'll do stocking stuffers. Okay so we'll start with books first. So she's obsessed with dragons and Pokemon. So you'll notice there are a few items <laughs> related to that. So first we have uh, the Dragonology book. This book is absolutely gorgeous inside. It comes with all the little lift the flaps and things. You've got all the different eggs for the dragon eggs and lots of great illustrations throughout. So I'm really excited for her to have this one. I also got her the Dragonology colouring book to go with. She really loves art and I thought it, it's not just a colouring book though, it does have information about the dragons on, but the designs are really intricate um, so she can have lots of fun colouring those um, and the paper is quite strong as well so I think maybe she could even do a little bit of watercolour on them. She also loves How to Train Your Dragon and she really likes this book, the Incomplete Book of Dragons. Um, so I got her a own copy. Um, again this is a really fun one and it does have some collector cards at the back. She adores the Wings of Fire series, so do I. It's actually really, really good. So I got her the next graphic novel um, in the series. So this is uh, book five. Uh, book six is not coming out to January, so I will get her that as well. Sort of a belated Christmas present, but it's uh, only on pre-order at the moment. And then I got her the last books in the series we didn't have. So this is book 11 um, from Wings of Fire. Book 12... Um, 13 is coming, it's not arrived yet, this is 14, and 15 is still in hardback, but the paperback is not out for months, so I decided to just go ahead and get her the hardback. And then finally for books, she is really into pumpkins, and she wanted to know, learn more about them, she wants us to, we grew a couple of them in our garden the other year, and it really interested us, so she wants to grow some more. Um, so I got her this book, Growing Squashes and Pumpkins, because she wanted to learn about all the different types, um... So I thought that would be a good one to have as well. There is one more thing Wings of Fire related that's not arrived yet. That is the official colouring book. Again, that is really good quality paper. Um, so you can definitely do watercolour in that. I've, I saw a few reviews that said that was fine. Um, and it's beautiful inside. Um, I just wish I had it to show you, but it's taking forever to get here. Okay, the next item I picked for her was this Aqua Dragons. Um... Habitat, it also has LED lights with it. We grew sea monkeys for a while and we absolutely she absolutely loved them. They were so fun. Um so when I, they've they had died though now. So when I saw this I thought it's perfect. Uh, I don't know if they're the same, I'm guessing they're similar, but you know, the fact that it says aqua dragons because she really wants to would love to have her own dragon. I think she's gonna be so excited when she sees this. She has no idea they even do this. So I think this is gonna be fun. So it's got the eggs in there and the food. Um, so it's really going to be a fun activity um, and she can watch, watch her little dragons hatch. I also got her this edible science experiment kit. Um, she really likes doing experiments, loves science, so I thought this would be a fun one and the fact they're all edible will make it even better. <laughs> As I mentioned before, she really loves Pokemon and I saw this trainer mission toy and I thought it looked really good. So basically you have to catch the Pokemon that are in your vicinity. Um, and yeah, you know, you have to detect them and then collect them. And I just thought it'd be a fun little thing that she could have um, uh, that would be Pokemon themed that she would really enjoy. Sort of a novelty item. The next thing I got her was a album to put all her Pokemon cards in. So I think this one holds 400. It's in like a little zip lock thing. So I don't really want to open it. But uh, it's pink. So I know she's going to really like that. And um, I think, it, as I said, I think it holds about 400 cards in there. The next item I got is for her room, and it's a dragon light. Um, so it's, you peel the brown off. Obviously, I'm not going to do that because it's not mine, but you can just about make out the dragon design. And then it has the light remote control. There's the base. So I think she's going to absolutely love it. The next item is a game. I got her the Dragonology game. I actually found this used on eBay because I couldn't find it on Amazon, um, but it looks like a really good game and I like that the figures are actual dragons, um, dragon shaped, so I think she's going to really enjoy that one. She has been collecting Cats vs Pickles for a couple of years now, and when I saw this little condo thing I thought it would be really fun. So again it's a little novelty item but I thought she'd really like it so she can build this little house, but you can also stack them in different ways as well, 
um, so I'm sure she'll have fun with that. She didn't need a new coat this year, um, the one I got her last year is still going strong, uh, but I thought this would actually be better um, and would actually help as well to keep warm through the winter. She doesn't like it when she's got jumpers on if her coat feels too bulky, so I thought this would be perfect. You know, when you've got a nice warm jumper on and it's all um, fleecy in part, so I think she'll really like that. These are her Christmas pyjamas and um, this is for Christmas Eve, the surprise bath bomb with a little squishy in. Okay, and then the final present I picked for her um, is the Nintendo DS Lite. So this was actually mine, I had it when they first came out, but I, I stuck it in a storage box and I found it recently and I thought, oh, that's the perfect thing. So I'm going to give her this. I have been looking at Switches, but they're just too expensive this year. Um, but I think this is sort of a really nice starter present so if we've got the console here um, I found her this little case which is new off eBay um, and with the stylus pen Pokemon theme and then she's got a section of games so we've got Sims 2 Pets, Ratatouille, and Nintendo Dogs, Dalmatian and Friends, the Zoo Tycoon where you build your own zoo, classic brain training <laughs> Another Nintendo Dogs, but this one is Dashan and Friends. Uh, she's got Bolt. I found a Dragonology game. Pinkie Pie's Party. Hamsters 2. Cats 2. And then I got these ones off eBay. Uh, these are without the box. We've got Polly Pets, um, My Vet Practice, Pets Nursery, Polly Pets, My Pet Hotel. Littlest Pet Shop and Tinkerbell and the Lost Treasure. Okay, moving on to the things she asked for. So she wanted some more Pokemon cards, so I got her this trading card set. Um, so this is what you get inside. So either an Espeon, an Umbreon, or a Sylveon. Four booster packs. I think she's going to really like that one. The next thing she asked for was this Mama Surprise guinea pig set. Um, it's one of the little live pets. So the guinea pig actually gives birth and you don't know how many you're going to get. And she just saw this and thought it was amazing. She really loves guinea pigs. Um, so I think she's going to be really thrilled when she finds out she got that one. The next item she asked for was the Battle Academy Pokemon game. So this is what it looks like. You do get three complete decks with it too. Um, so I think she's going to really love that one. And she realises that I actually picked it. We got her a Magic Mixie last year and um, she loved it. And they've now got the Magic Mixlings out. So when she found out that, she put those on her list. So I got her this one, which has got two cauldron, uh, two little um, Mixlings in. This set that has got three in. Um, she wanted the little house for them. So I got her that too. The next thing she asked for was the Hatchimal um, Revocation truck and it comes with the Poodle set. And then finally a Puppy Corn Surprise and a Kitty Corn Surprise. So I'm going to show you her stocking stuffers now. Okay, so here are our stocking stuffers. So I got her some of these Totes Toasties slipper socks, so there are two in there. The little Bunny Corn Rainbow Corn Surprise. And I got her a little pack of Colin Caterpillar Faces and a cracker which is really cute. <laughs> One of the Magic Mix Slings, the little cauldron. I got her a new watch, a Pokemon watch. A Gingerbread Man Bath Bomb. Another little trading card pack from Pokemon. Uh, let's see. I got her this little tin of Percy Pig Sweets and she can keep the little money box afterwards, which I thought was really cute. I got her a necklace and it is dragon themed. You can see that clearly enough if my camera will focus. There we go. It reminds me of Tsunami if you've read Wings on Fire. <laughs> I got her this little journal. She loves wolves as well. Um, it's really, really pretty. It's got little more bookmark in. The paper is really quite strong as well. So it looks like it's kind of embossed. It's really pretty. I got her some lip balm in this little compact with the puppies at the park. I thought she'd love that. And I also got her some hand cream. She really loves hand cream. This is red berry and cedar scent. So 
That was really nice from here, actually. Well, that might be the bath bomb. <laughs> then I got her this calligraphy set. She's been really wanting to learn calligraphy. Um, so you get the pen with the different nibs. You also get um, drafting pencil, putty eraser, workbook and instruction book. And here are your cartridges as well for your different colours for your pen. Or a pair of cosy socks. These are dog ones. That's what they look like. They kind of look like cavaliers and we have six of them so I thought they'd be the perfect socks. I got her this LED book light and bookmarks. It's like a two in one and you've got a kitty so I got her the kitty one. A little novelty item, this little dog pen. It's got a little bell on, thought that was cute. I got her the How to Train Your Dragon journal. Um, I thought this would be a fun one, so it's got lots of funny information, but it's also got pa pages for them to write as well. And then some goodies, so I got her some gold coins and these chocolate turkeys. I am also going to get her some jelly beans um, to put in as well, so that's everything that my 10 year old is getting for Christmas. Thanks so much for watching, I'll try and link what I can below. Take care, see you soon.